Hey everyone! Today for our math mini lesson, we are going to be learning how to draw shapes based on the information given. So that means that if I give you how many faces the shape has, how many angles, how many sides, you're going to be able to draw the correct shape. Let me show you what I mean. So I went ahead and set up a couple or two problems. Let's make sure we're in the camera frame. And this is going to be similar to the work that you're going to be doing today in your math rotation stations. So let's look at this first one. It says it has one face. Hmm. Well, we know that the face of a shape is essentially what it looks like. It's that one flat side. So we know that if it only has one face, it's a 2D figure. So we're not working with 3D shapes right now. Okay, let me look at my next clue. Five sides five sides. So I know that it's going to have five lines on to surround that one face. And finally, five angles. So I know that my sides, these five sides, are going to come to a point or an angle together. Let's go ahead and draw. I like to start off by drawing the sides first. And remember, they've got to connect to form that one face. So let's go ahead and draw our sides. So let's see, I'm going to one, so I've got one. I've got to make sure they connect. Two, three, four. Let's make that one a little bit more angular. Four and five. All right, so I drew my five sides. Let's make sure that they come together at five points or five angles. So let's see. One two, three, four, five. Remember my angles are the, where those two lines can connect. And let's see, one face. We know the face is what makes up the shape. So one face. So we correctly drew this shape. Let's try another one. So this one has one face as well, just like our previous one but it's got four equal sides, four equal sides. Hmm, what does that mean? That means that all of my sides have to be the same length. So notice over here, this one's a little bit shorter than this line, and this line's not exactly the same as this line. So these sides are all different, but they've got to be the same size for this four equal sides and four right angles. Hmm. Right angles we know look like L's. We know that they're 90 degrees. So my angles have to look like this. They've got to be that perfect L shape. All right, let's go ahead and see if we can do that. I'm gonna start with my four equal sides. So let's see, make them all the same size. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, four equal sides. Got that? They're all the same size. Not one smaller than the other one. One's not bigger than the other. Now our right angles. Let's make sure that all of our angles look like L's. They come perfectly to that point. Well, I see a little L right here. I see a little L right here. See a little L right there. And right there. Four right angles. So we got it. And then one face. I see one face, it's a 2D shape, not a 3D shape. Check it off. We have drawn both of our shapes based on the information given. So I have a pentagon right here, which means that it has five sides. And then I have a square, four equal sides, right here. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick little mini lesson about identifying shapes based on the information that you're given. Go ahead and practice them with your technology, your at your seat work, and your hands-on work. And I'll see you guys later.